Alright guys, so this is where it's all going to start. My buddy Rich here and I are going to head out. Got the trailer back there. Going to pick up another G8. Decided not to rip, a, rip apart my, uh, my good G8 that's fully complete to build this new project. So we're going to pick up another one and uh, got some pretty big plans. So we'll see. We'll see what happens, and uh, we're going to record everything, so it should be fun. good from the pictures so we should be all set but you never know so we're gonna check this car out hopefully everything works out good and load it up and head out all right so we are at a gas station truck stop I didn't get any video of us there at the house because there were some parts on the car still that um, needed to be swapped over that I didn't really want to pay for so um, as the car we're just trying to get the car for as, as little as absolutely possible so we uh, there's the uh, rear struts it had coilovers on it he had the front ones already swapped but the rear ones needed to be swapped over so uh, we Helped him swap them over and then threw the wheels on it and uh, pushed it up on the trailer and it was dark so I couldn't really get any video. We were just trying to get it done so I didn't get any video of that but we got the car. Um, we we're at this truck stop so I'm going to get some video of it and uh, so you guys can actually see what we picked up. Alright, here she is. It's wrapped. It's not wrapped very well but it, you probably can't see it on camera real too well. but. There's some imperfection underneath the paint, probably, that... And we just threw these spare tires I had on it, or wheels, so that uh, we could get up on the trailer. But... That's it. Now it's time to strip it down and gut it cut it all up make a race car yeah those these here come off and those come off and the whole front end comes out of it yeah well let me know when you want to get at it for sure well let's get your car in first <laughs> I should say your other car yeah get the other the diff put back in the other car and then this is gonna be a piece of cake, though. This will be you easy. Got two of them now. Yep. I have one. She ain't much right now. Not in them wheels. Anyone wants a uh, aftermarket exhaust for a G8? Feel free to hit me up. Won't be needing that. Not too bad. It's not too bad a shape. It looks a lot better here than it did where we were looking at it. Anyone need a uh, converter? I'm going to find out what it is. It might not be a stock converter. We don't know yet. This car had it up. 
had a uh, the car had an LSA uh, blower on it, and uh, so it, it's possible that that transmission might be built. Who knows? Uh, that might be an LSA converter, but I have no idea. I'm not super familiar with the LSA blower or LSA converters. Uh, so I'll have to check and see that might be an LSA converter, but I won't be needing that. Um, but yeah, so the car is here. We're going to start tearing it all apart, stripping it down. Everything's coming out of it. Um, I'll have a, possibly have a subframe, a whole, a whole rear cradle. Um, I don't know what diffs in this car yet, but I'll have a whole rear, rear cradle if anybody's interested. Um, I can't think of anything else really. Possibly a spoiler. So I won't be needing the spoiler off of it. That exhaust is gonna go. But it's here. What do you think? Pretty sweet. You excited? Yeah. Excited to start tearing it apart. Get to I know it. I'm excited. I can't wait to tear this thing apart. You got a boost gauge. Yeah, what is that in there? I don't know. All this stuff's gonna be gone. Boost gauge. None of this. Anyone needs a cluster, uh, any dash panels, any center console stuff, rear seats, that passenger seat's toasted, but you could probably, if somebody wants it, it's for sale. Um, I don't know what this gauge was. This is uh, AEM, AF, AFR, but I'm not sure if that's an actual wide band or if that's uh, that might that might be a yeah it might be a boost gauge. I'm not sure. Here's a connector right here. Exactly. Is there? Yep. The dash doesn't look in bad shape. <laughs> it's got a sunroof. Roof liner's all drooping, but that won't be a problem. We're gonna. I don't even know if it'll have a roof liner in it when we're done. Well, that's it. That is the car. This project is uh, well on its way. I'm just happy that we're not tearing apart my daily and doing this with that because as much as I wanted to build this uh, this whole deal I really didn't want to tear that car completely apart it's just in too nice a shape and I've had it for a while so I'm excited this is gonna be a fun build so stay tuned and uh, like Subscribe, turn on notifications, this build's going places.